Hey guys, how's it going? iPod Touch Helping here, and today's video is going to be for all of you that have the iPod Touch 4th generation, with this, which is the uh, iPod with the camera on the back and the FaceTime camera here on the front. So as you can tell, this is the iPod Touch 4th generation. And what I'm going to basically be showing you guys is how to get HDR photos on your iPod Touch. So uh, basically when you download it, which I'll show you guys in a second, you get this little HDR thing on the top and you can turn it on or off but we'll turn it on here and I will just take a quick photo it says saving HDR photo we click our photos and now you'll see we have two different photos alright we got this one which is the HDR photo and this one which isn't so basically what an HDR photo is it, is it basically takes two pictures and layers them on top of each other so if you look at these two um, it's hard to notice the difference but uh, this one is not HDR, that one is. So as you can tell, you know, you can see the light bulb. Uh, I don't know if you can tell through the camera, but in this one I can actually almost see the light bulb uh, when I look right at my iPod, but uh, you can't when it's on the camera. But you can tell the HDR photo is a bit nicer, um, I think. And really, those are indoor photos. Outdoor photos with HDR are much nicer, I can guarantee you that. So what you guys are going to want to do to do this is simply go into Cydia and open up, or sorry, open up Cydia and search HDR enabler. Um, so basically, guys, HDR photos. What it is, is it basically, like I said, takes two photos and layers them on top of each other. One, it may be taken from like a focusing on something that's dark and one focuses on bright, those two pictures, and then it basically combines them to make one picture with both bright and dark. So uh, for example, uh, if I was to take a picture of someone outside, um, you know, I could still see the brightness in the background and I could see still see the person. If, um, it's hard to explain here, but uh, you guys take some HDR photos and tell me what you think. So we'll go into search here and we'll search HDR enabler just like that there it is just click on it and you're just going to want to simply click install and uh, you'll have to respring your iPod and then right when you open up camera now you should get the HDR on thing so it's as easy as that guys this is a really simple tutorial here for you guys iPod touch helping if you guys missed my last video showing you guys how to change your slide to unlock color uh, you can check that out by just clicking on the video that's playing right now over there Follow me on Twitter, the link's in the video description, and also please subscribe to my other account. I'd really appreciate all those things, guys. Uh, thanks for watching this video. Hopefully this did help you iPod Touch 4th generation users out there. And uh, this is basically it, so I'll catch you guys later. iPod Touch helping, and that's about it.